I don't even know when to start talking or when I plan on start talking. I am so excited to do this series with you guys. I have been wanting to do this for so long and I never knew how to randomize a 3DS game. But oh my god, I'm so freaking excited to get into this. What's going on YouTube? Ladies and gentlemen, everyone within the United Family and welcome to my newest Let's Play here on the channel. Pokemon Omega Ruby Randomizer Nuzlocke. If you guys are as excited as I am, be sure to smack that like button. For those who are new to the channel, or if you're just now joining me here on this game or this video, third generation is my favorite generation of all time. And I was planning on doing maybe like an Emerald uh, Randomizer Nuzlocke, but then I was like, hold on. It is time to go and do... A randomizer on a 3DS game. I've never done one before and I'm so freaking excited that we're gonna be doing this on my favorite generation. You know, I don't even have time to talk about anything. Let's go ahead and get straight into this. Now, if you are new to the channel, what's going on? Uh, my name is United Gamer. You can call me Dylan and welcome to a channel where I try my best to make this seem like a family. Make sure to add me on Snapchat, join the Discord chat, get to know me, and let's get into it. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Bert, but everyone calls me the Pokemon Professor, and this is what we call a Pokemon. Man, I, I remember when this game came out, and I thought the way they did this was so cool. Probably my favorite introduction to any game. Maybe it's a little biased seeing how this is my favorite generation, so... This world is widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. We humans live alongside Pokemon at times, play together as friends, and at times helping one another out. Oh god. I'm so ready, and it's a randomizer. And sometimes we just like having fun battling, or whatever he said. I don't even- I can't even take the time to read the text, guys. I, I can't even- I can't stop smiling. Oh my god. <sighs> Let's get into it. So, obviously guys, you know what we're gonna do. This is episode zero where you guys are gonna be voting for my starter and I was about to say go ahead and do that but yeah it's a randomizer so you can't quite do that yet and I hope I did this right. For all I know I could have completely done this randomizer thing wrong and that would be not good. What are you a boy or a girl? Well I'm pretty sure I'm a boy so let's go ahead and uh, click that. Uh, as I said my name is Dylan. Man I'm gonna be smiling this entire episode and I hope that does not get on your nerves. I've just never been so excited for a series in my entire life. There's no there's no telling what we're going to face in this randomizer nuzlocke. And we can even do like the Delta episode in the randomizer. I wonder how that's going to work. I hope it does work. <laughs> I have no idea. I haven't watched anyone else do a 3DS randomizer. I just knew it could be done. And I knew I had to do this for Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. You know, in the future, I plan on maybe doing X and Y, Sun and Moon and such like that. Um, but as for now, I knew the first one had to be this game. So we need to go ahead and save Professor Birch. Because, well, we got to go through all this dialogue first with our mom. You know, moving into a new town. I, I was just thinking the other day when I was setting this up. I think it's funny how in every Pokemon game, you have a room, right? But you never go to the room. You're never in your room. You're always out catching Pokemon on your wild adventure when you're 10 years old. You're never in your room. You don't sleep in Pokemon. Which I'm okay with that. I don't know. I honestly don't know if Pokemon were real if I were ever be in my room either. That is, you know, not how things would roll. I remember actually, this is so random. Um, I'm just going to go through this text, guys. You know what it says. I don't have to read every single thing to you. But uh, I remember when Pokemon Go came out. I know it's not actual real Pokemon and such. But I remember how, like, seeing this one tweet saying... You know, Pokemon Go five years from now, like, our presidency, our government is all going to be determined by Pokemon Go battles. And I think that would be pretty awful, honestly. Our country would be destroyed. But it's fun to think about. All right, Machoke. You know, I'm ready to get on my adventure. I'm ready to see what my random starters are going to be. Let's see. It all, what, six gens. Obviously, we, we don't have seventh gen in this game. But six generations, there's no telling what it could be. And God forbid, I know some of you out there, when the last one I did, what was it, um, uh, I think it was my Platinum, uh, Randomizer Nuzlocke. All of you, there was like, Ho-Oh, Alakazam, and Weedle, and literally like 48% of the votes was Weedle. Luckily, Ho-Oh beat it by like 2%, but guys, 
You gotta be generous in this game. This 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 game can be punishing if you give me a horrible starter, like a Weedle, a poor Farfetch that no, no, no gets no love to him. Uh, but you know, be a little generous when we uh, get to see what our starter is. It's a Pedalberg gym. Maybe Dad will be on TV. Of course not. We never have a father. <laughs> The unspoken truth of the real world inside a Pokemon game. What a shame. Oh, that reminds me. One of Dad's friends lives in this town. Professor Birch is his name. He lives right next door. Well, we gotta go say hey to him. But we're gonna see some fine girl before we go to that. You know, we can't go up there quite yet. Let's go ahead and go inside here. Professor Birch, are you home, buddy? Can you give me a Pokemon? Oh, I am Dylan. You're our next door neighbor. Welcome. We have a daughter about the same age as you. You know, matchmaking, eHarmony at its finest right here. Uh, FarmersOnly.com, or PokemonTrainersOnly.com. Mmm. Oh, yeah. Do not tell my girlfriend I said that. Alright. May, I love you. You're, you're awesome. You caused me pain as a kid, as this was my first generation that I played. I was quite behind on my pro Pokemon journeys. Uh, but I'll never forget, this was probably one of the hardest rivals for me, this in first gen. Uh, but when I started off with Trico and she had her Combuskin and used Double Kick, it was my first time playing Pokemon, so I didn't know, you know, I wasn't used to it yet. And she destroyed me right before, um, right after Slateport, that battle up there. Oh my god, it was straight painful. May, I, I love you and all. You're super hot for your 10 year old self, but we gotta go. We gotta go see what kind of Pokemon we can get. Let's. It's time, guys. This is all this episode going to be. You know, I hate this. You know, I, I'm really excited to start this series. And all I get to do is do this one episode. Because uh, <laughs> I got to wait for you guys to vote. What should I do? What should we do? Someone has to go help. All right. So let's go to Route 101. And oh, I wish that was randomized. That would be really awesome. <laughs> you know, like a friggin' Rayquaza checking, chasing around Professor Birch. Hello! You over there! Please help me out! In my bag there are some Pokeballs! Here we go, everyone. The moment of truth! Let's see what we can get. We got Cyndaquil! I love Cyndaquil! It's an actual starter of Delcaddy and Skidoo! Oh, I, I am not, you know, I like, none of these are obviously, you know, super amazing, you know, out of this world, you know, in my verses I've gotten, or in my series I've gotten ho I've gotten Kyogre, I've gotten Deoxys, but I am completely fine with all three of these. I don't, I don't want to be favoritism, or show favoritism to anyone, but the water type Pokemon Cyndaquil is my boy. I know it's an actual starter, so he probably won't get voted. Skidoo would be fine too. He would be really awesome to have him. And then Delcaddy is probably my least favorite on this. But honestly, I am okay with any of these Pokemon. And that is it, everyone. That is episode zero of this series. We're going to get into this in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to smack that like button. Answer the comment question. And guys, if you're new to the channel, I hope you stay tuned. I hope you enjoyed the first episode. I will see you in the next episode. As always, everyone, this is not just a channel, it is a family. And I'll see you in the next episode. I'm out.